Now, after years of pleas, youth of the Niger Delta have decided to turn their demands for the construction of the east-west road into a protest. Dozens of young people blocked the road as early as six in the morning to ask federal government to get tr contractors to begin work on the road. They also parked trucks at both ends of the road leading to Port Hakop refinery in Dorama, the Free Trade Zone, the Nigerian Ports Authority and Orne Seaport. Any vehicle cannot apply this road anymore. They all divert to pass the internal road. So we say, what is actually happening? We've heard that the award, uh, the contract has been awarded, the money has been released. Then what is holding the job? What is holding the job? Anytime when people want to protest, they will all rush and bring some uh, strip of sand and pour, and that is the end of it. We have come out collectively in agreement to say enough is enough. The best that is raining the golden egg will not continue to suffer in abject poverty. If money that is being generated from Eleme is being used to fish road from Katsina to Niger, from Kanu to Lagos, the worth of this road does not worth more than 8 billion naira. From Kanu to Lagos is over 86 billion. We are asking Buari, what have we done against this government? Thank you. This is just a warning. If they come and promise us without implementation, we will come out and do a total shutdown. The level of damage and the dead on this road is too extremely high. All our link road has been destroyed. Um, anytime we got hold up on this road, more especially a Teho, a Bubu, Ogale, One, Abonsia, Alexa, Alode, and Aleto, to an extent to Abaju, has been destroyed. All the link road has been destroyed. For more than 20 years, this road has been like this. Each year they keep on approving, approving, approving. Nobody is doing anything, which is very bad. I think the damage of Niger Delta affairs to come and fix the road. If not, we will not leave the road. We have multinational companies here. We have the Indrama Element Petrochemical here in Element. We have the Petroco Refinery 1 and 2 right here in Element. And when you come to the road, leading to the place, it's bad. Buari should sign the contract directly to Julius Niger not to pass through Akbabio again. Let them come and fix this road. And why do you see that this, even that lazy breed that is already caught, we are just allowing that. Let's just let the federal government know that this road is nothing to write home about. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.